Hi, I'm Paula Elmer, Vice President and Chief Nursing Officer. Florence Nightingale once described nursing as the finest of fine arts. She explained that instead of working with canvas or marble, nurses work with the living body, the temple of God's spirit. Today, there are more than three million women and men who work in the fine art of nursing. We are pleased that Monroe Clinic is home to 300 of the very best. Their work here is more than a career, it's a calling, one that is showcased in many settings. In the hospital, making personal connections with patients while they see to their care and comfort. In the clinic, building long-term bonds with families they've served from one generation to the next. In the home, holding a hospice patient's hand as he faces the end of life's journey. In our administrative offices, offering skilled leadership and a valued perspective to advance our healing mission. Nurses often work in close partnership with physicians and other clinical staff. That partnership is one that is deeply valued. In fact, here is what they had to say about the importance of nurses in their practice. When I'm working, seeing patients in the hospital, I work with the emergency room nurses, the emergency room physicians, the hospital physicians, and uh, nursing staff in the hospital. And all of them are really great resources for me. I, the first thing I look to when I see a new patient in the hospital is I look at the nurses' notes because they really give a lot of good information. The nurses are great advocates for their patients. Uh, they always help me care for the patients once they're in on the floor. Um, and uh, all together we really try to provide great care for the patients. Now day to day in my clinic, uh, you know, from the very start when the patient comes in, we've got a great group of uh, OAs checking the patients in, working with my schedule, getting patients arranged where they need to be. We've got uh, 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 an MA, Carol, who's been with Monroe Clinic for over 25 years. Uh, nurse Janessa, who's been with Monroe Clinic since shortly after she got out of uh, nursing school. My partner, Dr. Kara Tower. All together, I mean, we work every day to try to, to, to provide the most high quality care kind of together as a team for, for our neurology patients. Uh, recently, we also added a memory clinic uh, to, our, to our group. And uh, Sarah Endicott is a nurse practitioner with experience in geriatrics and memory clinic and then Cindy Keller, who's a social worker. Um, and, and again, it's, it's been amazing working with all of these, these different practitioners and different people to help provide the best care for Monroe Clinic patients. As you can see, I surrounded myself by a lot of women uh, at my clinic, so, um, and I have three daughters and a wife at home, so I'm uh, constantly surrounded by women, but they're all wonderful and it all uh, work together to really provide great care for our patients. So truly we have some extraordinary nurses at the Monroe Clinic. Um, I've never worked with such a dedicated group of employees that really do whatever it takes to take care of that patient. And I know often that means they've given up family time. That's also very important to them. Um, but they are just um, the top, top notch professionals, great people to work with. Um, I also appreciate the um, way that they approach every day. Um, they look at what they've done at the end of the day and they say, geez, what could I do better? You know, what processes do we need to work on so tomorrow we provide a better service to our patient than what we've um, provided to them today? Um, they really are a, a great group of nurses to work with. I frequently get asked, how can you deal with sick and dying patients every day? And the thing that gets me through this is that I don't work alone, but I have a team. And the team consists not just of the nurse and the social worker that are in my department, but all of the nurses on the floor. And we all take care of these patients together. We all mourn their loss when they're gone, but we all support each other through that too. And really without the services and the help of the nurses in this organization, palliative care could not happen here. And I've never worked anywhere with such a positive atmosphere uh, that just seems to perpetuate itself, and I think that's just remarkable. I can't see myself anywhere else, and I love, it's my family too. My coworkers who I work with are my family. Monroe Clinic is my home. One thing is clear, whatever the setting, whatever the specialty, 
One thing remains constant in nursing. These healthcare professionals are caregivers in every sense of the word. Their hands provide both skill and comfort as they tend to the needs of body, mind, and spirit. And not because it's their job, but because it's who they are.